The new MacBook features a multi-touch trackpad that gives you more control than ever before. It's simple to learn, yet it allows for sophisticated gestures and shortcuts. At first glance, you'll notice a few differences between this trackpad and a typical one, but they work much the same. First, the multi-touch trackpad on the MacBook is actually made from glass with a smooth, touch-friendly surface. Next, there's no separate button. In fact, the whole trackpad is one big button, which gives you more room for gestures. Because of its unique one-button design, you can click anywhere on the trackpad. Just point and press. Press down twice to double-click and open a file or application. Dragging is just as easy. Click and hold the trackpad to select an item, and then drag the item on your desktop by moving your finger. If you're used to using a multi-button trackpad to right-click, or what we call secondary click, you'll love the new multi-touch trackpad. The easiest way to right-click is to just press the trackpad with two fingers. That instantly opens a shortcut menu. You can also customize your trackpad to right-click in either the lower left or lower right corner. Scrolling is one of the most common things you do with a trackpad. The multi-touch trackpad makes it easier than ever. Drag two fingers up or down to scroll vertically. The window content moves in perfect sync. Drag two fingers left or right to scroll horizontally. The multi-touch trackpad on the MacBook is so smart, it can tell the difference between the number of fingers you use and how you use them. Now you can gesture using two, three, or four fingers. Hold your thumb and index finger open in the middle of the trackpad and twist clockwise or counterclockwise to rotate a photo. You can also gesture to make images bigger or smaller. Place your thumb and index finger together on the trackpad and then spread them apart to zoom in. Do the reverse and pinch your fingers together to zoom out. Hold three fingers together and swipe left or right to advance back and forth through Safari pages, just like you do when you turn the pages of a book. Hold four fingers on the trackpad and swipe up to show a clean desktop when you have a lot of windows open. Then swipe down to bring your windows back. With four fingers, swipe down to see all of your open windows. Hold four fingers together and swipe left or right to open the application switcher. Then select the application you want. Configuring your trackpad settings and gestures is simple. The trackpad has its own pane in system preferences. You can set up your trackpad just the way you like and watch video demos of each gesture to learn how to use them. Try out the new multi-touch trackpad on a MacBook at your local Apple store.